Hello everyone and welcome to the Driver's Room uh, Festival of Speed, the DRFS for short. This is your host Kimaru speaking and it's no point in speaking of myself in third person since I'm not racing on uh, what I believe is a very horrible track. But regardless, let's get down for our grid walk and our video today. Starting off on pole, we have Dazman, PS Dazmaniac. We have Kenny, then we have Bullet, we have Dazzler, DJ Rice, our independent Monginio, Mr. Driver's Room, MJR Mercer, then we have Freddy, Mr. Furtick, Cafe Del Mar, Wilkinator and Rocker finishing off the field. All right, let's get down to business. All right, we're about ready to get the show on the road. Das qualified in first. Let's see how he does. We're off. Brands Hatch is in the track. I'm very familiar with or even like but oh that's lost p1 to kenny in the first corner bullet up into third desler fourth we have mong there in his grt liveried porsche oh and desler goes off Totally missing the uh, breaking point, I believe. Cafe, our wild card. Or is he officially a member of teammate? I think so. Rocker is with us. Oh, Rocker goes into the grass. Almost fitting to say, get off the grass, Rocker. And DJ's gone off. Full of chaos in the first lap. All right, let's see what happened to DJ. Oh, DJ and Moan comes together, and they're both off. I think DJ is waiting for Moan. Yep, looks like. Good driving from, uh, well, good respectful uh, waiting for from DJ. This is coming up in the back. It's going to be dangerous. We have Kenny still in P1, doing good so far, and we have him chased by Daz and Bullet. Bullet's looking close. Might go for a move very soon on uh, Daz, man. The leaders have pulled away a little bit from uh, the others in the back. There we have uh, Mercer. Staying ahead of Fer uh, Freddy. Oh, wow. Whoa. Wilco goes deep. And he's off. And whoa. Right into the wall. Damn. Now he's being challenged by Monk. There's nothing he's going to be able to do about Monginho. Can he hold? He loses to Mong. We have Kef. Daz has fallen down to third. What on earth is Daz cracking already? Or is he just playing the waiting game? Hope my uh, teammate can uh, get his best position ever in DRFS. Mercer still not getting away from Freddy or Calf. Still trying though. Oh, Freddy going deep again. 
look like they're struggling a little bit with the cars, but they should be a lot better than the shitty Renault. Oh, and Mercer. And he must have had an extremely bad e en uh, exit into the corner, out of the corner. He's being pursued closely by Cafe. Will Cafe be able to... Loving teammates' colors. There we have Rocker in the beautiful Sega. Wilkos dropped down to eighth. He's got my head among again. And Dessler, I've been to tenth. DJ struggling. Might not be a good track for uh, Ricey. Oh, very deep there. Can he still uh, in the lead? Very good driving from him so far. Don't know where Alex is. Oh! I think Alex had some Wi-Fi problems. So, um, he's not with us today. Kimi didn't want to, uh, didn't want, well... I shouldn't speak of myself in third person when I'm actually not on track. I didn't want to race this track because it's a horrid track in my eyes. I did do the Thursday race, but that was uh, from Muller's uh, persuasion. And that's still chasing. Oh, and Bullet goes off on the grass and takes a spin. See what? It, oh yeah, clips the wheel, clips the wheel, and it's all gone. It's all gone for bullet. Oh, and Freddy and Calf gets. Oh wow, that <laughs> that could have gotten dangerous. They got ahead without any issue. Now bullet is ahead of his teammate Rocker. Wilco still trying to catch up from his mistake earlier on. Being pursued by Mercer, who has fallen down to eighth, and Mongino. Ricey is still. What? What's happened to Desler? He's fallen down. I think he must have clipped the grass somewhere. So easy to do on this track. A lot of grass patches around. I have no idea what the corners are called. Like I said, this is not a track I'm familiar with, or even. Uh, and very fond of, so I couldn't tell you. I think one of the corners are called Druids. That's about all I know about this track. I think that's the uh, turn one and turn three. That's called Druids. Daz, Daz is still trying to catch up to uh, Kenny. Kenny's having a hell of a good race so far. Could uh, snag some good points for Neo Knights. Daz will snag very good points for uh, for uh, Firestorm if he can keep this up. Kim hasn't been present a lot this season, so uh, it's up to Daz and Craig and Jason. Cafe in third, gotten ahead of Bullet. Bullet's being chased by Freddy. Bullet's gotten ahead of Freddy again. Driving automatic. I think Freddy's in uh, cockpit view. The way he likes to race. Here we have Rocker trying to gain a little ground to Freddy and the rest. Wilco still trying to play the catch up game after his mistake. He'll have to drive like a bat out of hell to get back up. Mong still staying ahead of uh, Mercer. Merc no, Mercer's fallen down to nine. What's going on with Mercer? I think Mercer's having serious issues. It's being followed by Ricey. Oh, and Ricey misses. Oh, drifting through the corner. That's not going to be uh, very good for his rares. Losing a little bit uh, down to Mercer. As a result, Desler is still trying to play the catch-up game as well. 
He's very strong, but it seems like the Porsche doesn't agree with him for the moment. This is a uh, mid-season change that Boss did to uh, spruce up the uh, competition. Not letting people get too comfortable in one car. Next season we're gonna have one car for four races and then the drivers will have to switch to another car. Um, right now I am not saying what uh, what the cars are other than it's gonna be another GR3 uh, class that's still hasn't gained a lot on Canny but I think Canny well they're sort of similar on tires I think Das should be able to catch up if uh, he can just outsmart his opponent. Pressure Minto mistake. Bullet still trying to catch up to the rest. He's gotten ahead of Cafe. Cafe, I think, must be running with the stock setup. Tuning is allowed. BOP is manual. We have Wilco, has gotten himself back up at the fifth. We're very well driven. I think we might have lost Freddy. Maybe he's disconnected again. Mercer's back up into sixth. Rocker, seventh. We have Ricey in eighth. Monk's fallen down to eighth again. I think he's struggling as well. And Dessler's off on the grass. Yep, this is not a fun race for Dessler. I think he must hate this track like I do. Sort of seems that way. Oh, and Daz has gotten ahead of Kenny. Let's see how this all went down for these two. Oh, and Daz get a, gets a way better exit out of that corner. Takes Kenny on the back straight and is up into P1. Well done, Ken uh, Daz. Now it's just a matter of keeping the position, keeping everything under control, not breaking under pressure. Looks like uh, Daz has got himself a little gap already. Tires are looking surprisingly good so far. Das will have to dig down deep. Maybe he can make this stick. Bullet still ahead of Cafe. And Wilco's gone off into the gravel and grass. Get off the grass, Wilco. Mercer's catching up. Same with Rocker, DJ, and Monk. Very unusual to see Desler in last place. Mistakes do happen. Oh, we have Ricey. He's gone off. The last corner is also particularly blah, difficult. Can't even say that word. That's from coming for not being, you know, having English as my first language. And, you know, stuff happens. Can't even speak properly sometimes. Oh, a lot of screams of tires. We're nearing the halfway point of our 30 minute uh, race. Cafe still trying to catch up the bullet. He's been into the pits. Fresh tires. So has Bullet been. So Kenny and Dasman still staying out. The tire wears are identical. Oh, I think Das might be trying to push the car a little bit 
too much. Kind of still losing down to uh, to Daz though. If he can only keep this up. Bullet still staying clear of Calf. Mercer looking secure so far in fifth. Rocker still trying to uh, catch up a bit. Then we have Mung. Also trying to uh, catch up to the rest. Wow, Ricey's tires are looking horrible. And Wilco's been into the pits. He's gotten some fresh rubber, and Desler's moved out of the competition. He's had enough. We have a yellow flag, and Mong spun. Mong, oh, and he collects Ricey. Oh, just at the same place as they did earlier. There was nothing Ricey could do. There's no need for waiting for Mung. Oh, such an unlucky situation. Let's see what happened to Mung. Oh, clips the uh, gravel and it's all over. And then, oh, he just unghosts in front of Ricey and it's basically uh, over and out. Oh, such an unlucky, uh, unlucky uh, drive for uh, for Mon. And Mongino has thrown in the towel. He said, "To hell with this." Oh, such an unlucky event for uh, Mongino. And we have Rocker into the pits. He's gone off on Super Soft. Wilco's gotten up into sixth. Ricey has gone to uh, the pits. Gotten on a fresh set of supers. We're only eight in this race. Oh, and Wilco with a little drift into the back straight corner. Yeah, Mercer. Kenny's dived into the pits. Will he try for an undercut for uh, Daz? Or is Daz too far away to uh, do anything about? Oh, oh, upsets the car. Don't do many of those mistakes, Mr. Daz. You're, uh, you're gonna lose that lead. Kenny and uh, Das really, they've really pulled away from the rest of the field. Bullet starting to wear his tires. Same with Cafe. Wilco still staying ahead of Mercer. And we have Rocker and Ricey all the way in the back. Not having a good race. Uh, tonight. Oh, Caffey is kicking up some dust. And Daz has dived into the pits. Let's see where he comes out. Comes out right in front of Kenny. Will Kenny be able to make a move? No. Das secures P1. Oh, wow. Kenny will have to dig deep to try and get, uh, get ahead of uh, Daz. 
Will he be able to? That's the big uh, $24 million question. Has really shown their strength in tier one uh, tonight. Everything's clicking for them, and looks like Canny is moving a little bit closer to uh, to Daz. Canny's got a couple more uh, laps, warmer tires than Daz. Best sector time. Bullet there. Pulled by his lonesome. Pulling away from Cafe. Wilco. Playing the lonely uh, soldier. There we have Mercer. Being followed by Rocker. Rocker has slightly more worn uh, back tires. Shouldn't hold him up too much. We know how strong Rocker is, he's just not had the best of luck. But Rocker's definitely a one to watch. Very, very strong driver. He just needs that perfect race that we all strive for. Bullets di dived into the pits. His tires are not that bad, but Cafe's gone into the pits as well. Very surprising. They uh, might have gone in a little too early and uh, just taken on tires to last the race out. I remember from the DRGC days, we pitted every 10 minutes. Tires were basically gone after 10 minutes, and we'll go with a slight drift into Druids. Mercer still not getting any ground on Wilco, it seems, but Rocker might be gaining a little bit on Mercer. Let's head down to Ricey. He's passing through Druids now. Oh, yep, taking a little extra... Uh, wide uh, track. Rice is also an extremely, extremely strong, um, strong racer, but uh, he's, uh, he's not had very much luck with him in DRFS. And Dazman with a new, uh, well, personal best lap, new sector best. Kenny has the best lap of the race so far. He's still hanging on, uh, hanging on Daz. Like a mosquito, you just can't uh, seem to get away from your face or a small fly. They just stick around you. But they're doing good so far. Very good uh, and very awesome drive from these two. Good to see them in the front. Bullet still sticking in third. Comfortable uh, gap down to Calf. Cafe is flashing his lights. The, the result of uh, raping your uh, controller 
when they're steering? No. Misuse, well, what's the word? Abusing your controller while driving. I've uh, never understood why um, people press down the left stick so hard. I don't do that when I, uh, when I drive with a pad, but I guess everyone's driving style is different and unique. Wilco still staying safe and secure in fifth. Mercer still trying to catch up some ground to Wilco. Also an extremely uh, consistent driver. Not had much luck with him. But uh, he can turn out to be very dangerous when, uh, when you challenge him because he's that damn good. Mr. Driver's Room, ladies and gentlemen. And we have Rocker. Everything seems to be slowing down a little bit in this race, except for these two. Candy's been hanging on to Das for the entire race. Doesn't seem to want to let go. Let's go on board with Kenny. cut the corner a little too much. I hate these two corners. Kenny's just doing enough to uh, not fall behind, but doesn't seem to be able to catch up much to uh, to the race leader. Ricey's gaining on Rocker. Could this be a fight for seventh at the end? The tires look the same. Ricey's tires are looking a bit worse than Rocker's at the moment, but could he be able to gain on... Uh, on Rocker, brother of uh, Thor, this man. Brother to Murkoff, he's racing in uh, tier two. And Wilco goes into the pits. Must have had enough of those uh, worn tires. That puts Mercer up into fifth. Wilco all the way down into eighth. Will he come out before? He comes out just ahead of DJ. DJ will have nothing left in the tank to challenge Wilco in the last remaining uh, minutes. The tires are not permitting to do so. Oh, look, I think Rocker might be struggling. He might be struggling on the tires. DJ's looking close. Wilco will most definitely get ahead of Rocker, that's for sure. Just look at the grip difference between these two. The tires aren't looking that bad, but still, Wilco will be able to possibly get ahead of Rocker. Right now he has the superior grip. Will he be able to get past Rocker? Oh, Rocker goes deep. He pushes. Oh! And Wilco gets a one and a half second penalty. What the f... 
Wow, and Rocker just does the honorable thing and slows down, but holy hell. Yeah, that's... That... Yeah, that's... Oh, this game is just... All manner of... F-word. And... Because of that mistake, Ricey's up into 6th. Mercer, luckily for him, he's up into 5th from Wilco's pit. And Cafe still staying strong in 4th. Bullet looking lonesome in 3rd. Uh, we have Kenny, he's still hanging on uh, Daz's ass. I think he might be out of the slip, but he's still hanging on. And with the best sector time as well. Daz will just have to uh, bring the car home. No mistakes. Just bring the car home. Get it done. He's pulled away a significant amount from Canny now. Canny won't be able to keep this up. Canny's tires on the front are looking wow, bad. And Canny goes off into grass. Loses a lot more time to Das. I think Das will have this in the bag if he doesn't make a single mistake. Das has looked very strong throughout this entire race. This will definitely be uh, a great win for the Daz man. Good points for Team Firestorm. There's nothing Kenny can do right now. Bullets in third. Very safe from Calf. Look at the distance between them right now. I think Cafe might have had a mistake somewhere. Mercer, not close enough to uh, do anything about Cafe. Ricey looking safe in 6th. Uh, we have Wilco in 7th and Rocker. He's dropped all the way down into 8th. And I think his mojo is gone. His concentration is all over the place. This is going to be lapped by Daz. The very last lap. There we are. Last lap. Will uh, Rocker slow down for uh, the Daz man? Or will he play hard to get? There we have Kenny in the back. And Cafe's finished in the fourth. Looks like Bullets is running another lap. Oh, and Rocker goes off into the grass. Not a good day on the track for Rocker. Very good drive from Daz, congratulations. Very good drive from Kenny. And a very boring drive from Bullet. Thank you all for watching. Come back next week for uh, Lago Maggiore GP2. And uh, until then, we will speak soon. Ta-da!